Korea and its allies as the Philippine Navy pursues more Pohang-class corvettes. The country is looking to strengthen its maritime defense and security capabilities to ensure a formidable presence in the region as we complete this epic sea journey. The potential of the Pohang-class corvettes for the Philippine Navy is undeniable. It could be a real game-changer, ensuring the best maritime defense and security for the Philippines. The Philippine Navy has expressed interest in enhancing its Navy capabilities by acquiring additional Pohang-class corvettes from South Korea. The warships are seen as vital assets to complement the existing surface fleet and replace the World War II-era patrol boats as well as to expand the Philippine Navy fleet. Especially the Navy has taken a proactive approach by signaling its intention to purchase at least two decommissioned Pohang-class vessels. The Philippine Navy remains hopeful that the process will go smoothly so that the vessels can be delivered to the Philippines soon. Potential acquisition of more Pohang-class corvettes has been boosted by the Philippine Navy's partnership with Hyundai Heavy Industries Shipbuilding Industries has selected two new Korean corvettes advanced subsystems and munitions including Indonesia. Anti-Starfish Missile Boats and Navy Shield CMS among other advanced technologies in light of the ongoing potential acquisition of more Pohang-class corvettes has been boosted by the Philippine Navy's partnership with Hyundai Heavy Industries Shipbuilding Industries has selected two new Korean corvettes advanced subsystems and munitions including Anti-Starfish Missile Boats and Navy Shield CMS. Among other advanced technologies in light of the ongoing modernization efforts and the need for coastal defense and patrol, Philippine authorities aim to secure a total of six Pohang-class corvettes organized into two corvette squadrons. After the successful acquisition of one of the vessels named BRP Conrad Yap PS-39 which has been in service since 2019 the acquisition process for the second Pohang-class Corvette has been well underway while specific details and transfer timeline have yet to be disclosed. These vessels are considered highly capable in anti-surface and anti-submarine warfare making them valuable assets to safeguard the country's territorial waters and interests held by South Korea's retired Pohang-class corvettes. Significant interest from friendly nations Peru, Vietnam, Colombia and Egypt are among the countries that have received these vessels to strengthen the strong defense cooperation between the South countries. It was previously reported that a Philippine Navy delegation conducted a joint visual inspection in South Korea in November last year for the possible transfer of the decommissioned Pohang-class corvette, the Rock Andong PCC-771 that has served the Republic of Korea Navy for 32 years. This will be the second Pohang-class corvette from Seoul in 2019. South Korea donated the Roxas Chungju PCC-762 now called BRP Conrado Yap PS-39. The two new 3,100-ton corvettes are currently based on the HHIHDC-310 design that measures 116 meters in length and 14.8 meters in width. Its top speed is 25 knots with a range of 4,500 nautical miles. HHI said the ships will be equipped with an active electronically scanned array ISA radar that can enhance the detection capabilities of anti-aircraft, anti-ship and vertical launch missile systems. HHI also built two Rissol-class multi-rotor frigates that are now in service with the Philippine Navy. The AP-16 billion deal in 2016 the Philippines, an archipelago with one of the world's longest coastlines and a large island population faces a variety of maritime security challenges including incursions by Chinese vessels in the western Philippine Sea. South Korea is currently the world's largest shipbuilder. The ninth largest arms exporter has been a major source of military hardware. For the Philippines from military trucks to light ironclad alliance fighter jets Manila and Seoul Security's ties have grown rapidly over the years after being strengthened by the deployment of Philippine troops during the Korean War in the 1950s. Since 1984, a total of 24 Pohang-class corvettes have been commissioned into the Republic of Korea Navy. The class was decommissioned in 2009 and replaced by the FFX program in January 2023. Five corvettes remain in service with the RN and seven have been transferred to other navies. The Pohang class is around 10 meters longer, 
100T heavier and 1 knot faster with a maximum speed of 32 knots than the Dong class due to a better length to speed ratio during sea trials.